go, man. All right, I'm Don Clark, and I'm owner operator of the world famous Marvel White Bluegrass Bus Museum. Step on inside for a tour of the inside of it. We're going back in time, 52 years. This door right here about everybody from uh, the king of country, or the queen of country, uh, Kitty Wells, to the king of bluegrass, you know, Jimmy Martin's on this door. Bill Monroe, Grandpa Jones, Dwight Yoakam, everyone that's been on this bus one time or another. Going inside, and this is what it's like, stepping back in time, 52 years. This is how the artists used to tour back in the 50s in, this, in old buses like this. I mean, this thing's even got an eight-track tape deck up here, you know, where we play the old bluegrass eight-track tapes. And, uh, this right here is off Lester Flats mailbox out of Sparta, Tennessee. He was in the Foggy Mountain Boys and played with Bill Monroe. He's like original recipe, top shelf of bluegrass music. This right here is off of Bill Monroe's old home place in Rosine, Kentucky. Uh, that was off his house where Bill Monroe was born. And that's one of the bluegrass boy reunion belt buckles right there that was donated to the bus. And of course, Bill Monroe matches. Don't get no hotter than that. <laughs> this this is an old Victrola here. This is how they used to listen to records back in the 50s and the, into the 60s. And uh, we'll give you a little taste of it right here. It's just got a steel needle, no tubes, no electricity, nothing. This is this is how it used to be. That's Roll to My Sweet Baby's Arm by Lester Flatt and Earl Scruggs. That was a number one hit for them. And as we go back into the the back of the bus here, we even got some drive-in uh, speakers here that the uh, the eight-track tape plays through right there. And we got this old banjo here that's been signed by Earl Scruggs and about everybody in uh, bluegrass. These suspenders here were worn by Johnny Cash. Those are some of his suspenders. And here's some here's Jimmy Martin's old bus, like like the old Martha White bluegrass bus right there. That's Jimmy Martin's right right there. Back here we've got this is the one of the bed compartments we got Jimmy Martin's jumpsuit right here and we got some Bill Monroe uh, drawings and that's a uh, little Jimmy Dickens Hawaiian shirt right there and and it just goes on and on and on and on <laughs> Martha White flower sacks Martha White's been sponsoring their Grand Ole Opry since just about the beginning and they still are the number one sponsor of the Grand Ole Opry okay well we're off to another festival here we're gonna go to Lebanon Tennessee so we'll see you all down the road you hear you're listening to Ram Radio if you're looking for Shania Twain you're lost but if you want to hear some real country music hang around and you'll hear country music the way it was always meant to be